this is oatmeal, parchment paper, on a toaster tray, and this is banana, okay, ripe banana. That's what you do. You mush it. So it took 30 seconds and I give it a few more seconds. Okay. Now I'm gonna add just a bit of vanilla. And uh, one cup of oatmeal on one banana. That's all. Now I'm trying to integrate. Okay. I hope this banana is not too small and it will take in all the oatmeal. Should I drop some water in here? Yeah. I'll add a little bit of water. Enough or should I keep going? Yeah. Not supposed to even have water in this recipe. But water doesn't cost anything, so cheap way to uh, kind of uh, lower the labor intensity to help integrate what will better so now I think I'm done right, I'm gonna put this stuff I call it dough right can you call it dough What milk do to the shit? Hopefully it will fit. And I'm gonna stick it to the toaster oven. It more looks like granola bars to me more than what milk cookie, but. What do I know, right? I'm just a consumer, not producer. So my toaster oven have convection mode. Also it has toaster whatever it's called and I'm just gonna put in convection it heats from top and from bottom and uh, it also spins the fan I think it's fine now only question how much time and I think I'll kind of put it on 30 minutes although 15 okay 25 minutes on convection mode or 30 minutes on so 300 degrees all right that's all you need that's what you're left with let's assume banana could it should be 25 cents cup of mod will 25 cents and it's gonna give us one two three four eight 8 to 10 pretty nice oatmeal cookies or you call it granola bar. Ganola. Ganola. Alright, have a nice day.